What's up, family of strong soul survivors? It's your sister, soul survivor. And yes, 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 finally, things are opening back up. And the pandemic, you know, it's a plan. It's a plan and it's a purpose for to keep us suppressed. But we're going to go past all of that. And I just want to tell you what my purpose is all about for this pandemic. I and mean, it was the purpose way before this pandemic. But what I have in mind is a soul survivor, sober living home association that I have already set up way before the pandemic came into play. So I just wanted to do something to give back to the community. And where the community needed the most was women, veteran women. So me being a vet, I've served and I fell on hard times, but what helped me to get through, I prayed, I, I did a lot of things to help myself get through and survive that. I got through without the 12 step. God was my 12 step. But unfortunately, everyone don't have that. So what I wanted to do is reach back to my Conrad women, the, the, the ones that served our country and that have served in our families that fell on hard times and need a hand up. You know, I just wanted to be that support. I wanted to help my sisters get through that in their lives. So I am asking you to support my vision on helping female veterans and those with mental illness issues that have substance abuse problems and light, bare minimum mental illnesses. Help me to help them and make our community a much better place to live. All they need is a hand up. I know everyone is going through a lot in this pandemic, but if you can, that every little bit helps. We take little donations and large donations. Whatever you can give will be greatly appreciated. Look, this is, I know it's my vision, but I want you to help me with this cause. I need your help just to help get them on their feet. A woman is out here she's away from her children she's away from her family she is the base of the family unit so help me reach back and help my sisters Woo! my heart is in this thing y'all please mm -hmm. forgive me mm -hmm. my heart is in this thing and i just want you to catch my vision and to help support soul survivor sober living association foundation which before the pandemic, we had already changed the name. So the paperwork hadn't came back. We changed this to Soul Survivor um, Supportive Living um, Foundation. We made it a foundation because we want this thing to be worldwide also. We want to have it where women can come in with their children, with their families and recover from substance abuse or mental illness. We, we, we're just starting this thing out, but what I've done already, because my heart is so into this, I have already remodeled a five bedroom, three full bath home for these women. And all I need is some donations to get some furniture in there. I see beautiful furniture in there. I see a loving home to where they can come and be comfortable. They don't have to recover with a lot of men. And we don't have these type of homes for women for the simple fact it's a, it's a lot of men in there. So how can one woman recover from anything when she's surrounded by a lot of men? It's a distraction. Women, we, we need our own. We need our own home for veteran women who have served the community and served this country. So I'm asking for your help. I'm asking for you. whatever you can give appreciate it. We just celebrated those that have fallen from, you know, those heroes that had, we honored those from falling. We, we, we failed, a lot of times we fail to remember those are, that's still here, that served as well, that's on hard times. So while we honored those who had 
not just transition for fighting in our wars. We need to honor those that still alive, that serve our community and our country. So I'm asking you, as Sister Soul Survivor, please support Soul Survivor Sober Living Home Foundation. And I think, I'm gonna thank you already in advance. Share this video. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And if you're not a subscriber to my channel, hit that subscribe button and let me know. Yes, also, I want to let you know that this is a 501c3 already set up. Everything is already in the play. We're just waiting for this pandemic to be lifted so we can help some women out there who are in need of recovery. I love you. Peace and blessings.